Hello children, how are you? I hope you are fine. Today we are discuss about NSO National Science Olympiad. So let's start and our first chapter is plants. Chapter 1 plants. So let's start. First question a uh, plants gives us food grains what are the example of such grains number a uh, wheat and rice number b maize and barley and number c gram and pulses and d all of this our right answer is d our right answer is d because Food grains are small dry seeds which are grown by human beings for food just like wheat, rice, maize, barley, gram and pulses. Next number 2. We get gum from the dash tree. So our right answer is a acacia acacia tree is the right answer next number three the stem juice of the rubber plant is used to make used to make number uh, option uh, rubber number b henna number c paper and number d none of these so our right answer is a uh, rubber we get rubber juice from rubber tree next number four select the pair that is similar to the given in the box based on their type here is one hibiscus tree and pumpkin one is hibiscus plants and one pumpkin so our option a is basil's rose number b bottle goat Grape vine number C money plant P number D hibiscus and watermelon. So our right answer is D hibiscus and watermelon because hibiscus is a sharp and watermelon is creeper. So also upper Next, number 5, we get oil from all of the following plants except A. A is, number A is the right answer because number B, mustard, number C, ground nut, number D, coconut, coconut, so all are source of oil. Next, number 6, select the odd one out based on the edible part. Our right answer is A. We eat flour or broccoli. Well, we are eat green leaves of lettuce, cabbage and mint. Next, number 7, which leveled part in the given picture of a plant prepares food? Our right answer is A, means W, because here is indicate leaves, leaves, so leaves is the right answer plant prepare food with leaves next number eight which of the following figures correctly shows the movement of water in the plants our right answer is a our right answer is a because here arrow is upper Water is absorbed by root and moves to upper parts of the plant's body. Next, 
Number 9 Saloni describes a plant that she has seen in the field identify the plants it's it is a small bushy plant with hard stem and branches we get soft fiber from it which is used for stuffing pillows so our right answer is b cotton plant cotton we are stuffing in the pillows Next number 10 what is the characterized of the plant whose product in shown is this fruit's name is strawberry so our right answer is c the plant has weak stem and is grown along the ground next number 11 how is a young plant different from an adult plant our right answer is c the adult plant has flower but the young plants does not next number 12 different plants live for different time periods arrange the following plants starting from the plants with shortest life span banyan rice rose Our right answer is option B because at first rice, next tree, rose, then banyan. Banyan tree can live for hundreds of the years. Rose plants live for few years. Well, rice plants has life of only few months. Okay, next. Number thirteen. What will happen to a plant if we remove all the flowers from it? Number thirteen. Our right answer is a. Uh, it will not produce fruit. It will not produce fruits. Number fourteen. Select the correct statement out of the following. Our right answer is. D because coffee is obtained from the seeds of plants it's correct sugar is all is made from stem juice of a grass henna is obtained from the leaves of shrubs all options is correct so our right answer is D all of this next number 15 Study the given classification chart and select the option that correctly fills the empty space D and E. Medicinal plants also used as spices. C A cinnamon and neem, B cloves and mustard, number C tulsi and guava, and number D cardamom and spinach. Our medicinal plants is um, definitely turmeric and uh, cloves and mustards. Cloves and our right answer is B. Cloves and mustards have medicinal properties and they are also used as spices. Right. Next number sixteen. What are the similarities between the plants bearing the fruits as shown here is a watermelon and a big pumpkin the fruit shows are watermelon and pumpkin both plants are creepers so they have weak stems and they grow along the ground both the plants bear flowers so they produce seeds also so our right answer is b our Right answer is B. Option A, option C, and option D. Next, number seventeen. Study the given figure. Which of the following best represent X and Y? Plant with trunk. Plant from which we get well and 
Number Y small plant with soft stem B right answer is B because X coconut and Y mustard one is a herd plant trunk means it's a tree and we get coconut oil from it and mustard is a herb with soft stem it also provides us oil next number 18 study the given flow chart which of the following is correct regarding this number 18 number 18 number 18 our right answer is C right answer is C because E is a sharp here is E E is a sharp small plant with woody stem next number 19 the given figure shows a plant uh, with its plants labeled as P Q R and S which of the following is correct regarding this option A we eat R of almond B we eat P of broccoli number C we eat S of cabbage D we eat Q of cactus our right answer is B we eat P of broccoli we eat broccoli next number 20 refer to the given word chop table select the boxes that will give answers to the following question following question number a name of the plant whose fruit is used to get oil so number 14 coconut coconut number 14 and number 11 number box coconut 14 and 11 and uh, uh, next B name of the plant part of the eaten radish so root hoga so 2 R O and number 13 O T R O O T root so our right answer B 14 11 and number B ka answer 2 and 13 I hope you all I enjoy this video have a good time thank you thank you so much joining this class see you soon with a new video tata bye bye